Hare Krishna. I've been asked to speak about Lord Balaram. So, of course, Lord Balaram is Krishna's elder brother, Dalji. He enjoys freedom in his dealings with Lord Krishna as the elder brother. So, Lord Balaram serves Krishna in all the different rasas. He enjoys that freedom, being the elder brother. Lord Balaram associates with Lord Krishna in their childhood pastimes, going to the forest with the cows. Krishna carries the flute, Balaram carries the plough. Lord Balaram is famous as Haladara, the carrier of the plough. The plough, just like before, you, you plant a field, you have to plough the field first of all. And after ploughing the field, then you're ready to plant the seeds. So Lord Balaram, because he's the original spiritual master, the, the significance of the plough is it's used to prepare the ground for the planting of the seed. Just like the spiritual master comes and he plants the, the seed of devotion, the bhakti lada beach, the seed of devotion in the heart. So Lord Balaram is the one who prepares the ground for that purpose. Lord Balaram is give, he's given that name, of course, because he's very powerful, he's very strong. <laughs> but when Prabhupada asked who's, who's strongest, Krishna or Balaram, he pointed out Krishna is stronger because Balaram leans on Krishna. Krishna holds up Balaram. This is the loving dealings between Krishna, Lord Krishna and Lord Balaram. They enjoy going in the fields and they enjoy also facing the different demons. Lord Balaram also helps Lord Krishna in dealing with the different demons when they come to give trouble to the people of Vrindavan. I heard an interesting class one time. His Grace Barijan Prabhu was talking and he was telling us how Srila Prabhupada had said, if you have any trouble, if you're feeling some anxiety, problems, go to Lord Bhava. Tell Lord Balaram. Lord Balaram is very helpful. He's very sympathetic. He likes to hear from his devotees. So this is Lord Balaram's mood. That he's very affectionate and kind to his devotees. And he's very ruthless in dealing with those who are not devotees, who are against the service of Krishna. So we're celebrating Lord Balaram's birthday. He appears as a seventh child of Vasudeva Devaki, but he was transferred to the womb of Rohini by the Yoga Maya potency. He appears from the womb of Rohini, so he's also known as Rohini Nanda, one who gives pleasure to Mother Rohini. Lord Balaram gives pleasure to all the devotees. So let's all take part in this Balaram Purnima. Let's worship Lord Balaram with all our heart and soul and feel the pleasure of Krishna consciousness, which is not different from Balaram consciousness. Hare Krishna.